Gordon was finally back from the works, and he was pretty happy. His footplate, front bogey wheels, pistons, and side rods were fixed. However, Gordon had an unpleasant surprise just for him. Spencer was back. He was pulling the express while Gordon was gone. The other engines were quite surprised of Spencer's smooth performance of work and really appreciated it. But not really for Gordon. He took quite an offense of this and started to judge Spencer once again. That evening, Gordon decided to ask his friend Percy for information about Spencer. Oh, hello, Gordon. It's nice to have you back again. Yes, indeed, I assume. Why is Spencer here? To pull the express. Why else? Percy, that's what I want to know. Why is he pulling it? It was too tiring for Henry and James. I mean, it is pretty tiring to do many jobs at the same time. Wasn't there another engine that could do it, Percy? No, Gordon. No, there were no other engine. Can't you just deal with it? I mean, what's the problem? Gordon simply remained silent until the rest of the day. The next day, Gordon was just resting up in an old shed. Suddenly, he saw such a hat coming in his car. Ah, good morning, Gordon. How are you? Why are you here, however? Uh, uh, don't mind me, sir. Okay, then. Well, good morning. Uh, James is out of order at the moment. Getting fixed, and Spencer will be taking the express. Can you do uh, James's jobs, please? Gordon felt offended and was grumbling to himself, while Bulgy was chuckling to himself. Later, Gordon was ready to pull his goods train when. Oh, well, hello, Gordon. Pulling those. Dirty trucks, I say. How afraid you are of showing it. Go off and do your work, Spencer. No, no, Gordon. I still need to have my passengers go in the coaches. Ooh. Sorry, Gordon. Got some work to do. See ya. Next time. Gordon grumbled to himself, and then he departed the station. It wasn't long before Gordon reached the next station and started to stop. When he heard the news come up, Quick! Spencer is stuck on the hill! You need to go and help him! You're the nearest engine by! Still hasn't learned about hill, has it now? Come on, Gordon! We need to go and help him! With pleasure! Gordon went out of the station to go and help him. Spencer was looking down when Gordon arrived. Well... What do we have here? Listen, can we just not talk about it and get up the hill? Of course, said Gordon. Wait, what? We don't need to tell everything to everyone, don't we? Spencer muffled a yes. The two would laugh, and the two became friends again.